Hello, Bobby Bites, and welcome to uh, Cloud Climber. I woke up like this. Another day has arrived. I'd best get my water before going to work. Is my water in a bucket? Sure isn't. Awesome. It looks pretty... Pretty dusty out there. Chest key. Old E. I have a chest key. Stand diary, page 1489. I may need to get to the neighboring tower in the future, but I know the other builders keep the entrance to the bridge locked. I saw a key on the table at the top of our tower a few weeks ago before I went to get more building supplies. I haven't been up there in a few days, so I'll need to check if it unlocks the bridge door. If the other towers ever become vacant, I might need to get across, so I'll have to keep this in mind. So we're going up. Sounds like a plan. That is a chest key, and that is a chest. Chest key was used. Is that my water? Bucket of water added to inventory. Sweet. No one can stop me, I'm on my way up. Construction on the last tower stopped weeks ago. I can only assume that the builders have met their fate by now. What fate? I believe it's safe enough for me to go and continue building higher yet from where they left off. I'll need to travel across the other two towers to get there, but I'm sure I can find a way. Big bridges. Uh, why are we building? And why is this not OSHA approved? There's gotta be a reason why everyone has perished. Bernie the Great and Terrible, Diary Page 69, nice. For months we've been building faster than ever, yet it seems as if every time we complete a new level, the clouds raise higher and higher. I could have sworn we were close to them decades ago, but we're still not done yet. I can only hope that we're getting close. Signed, Bernie the Great and Terrible. So, towards the clouds, trying to reach the clouds. For what reason? Anything in here? Wooden brick? No water for me? This is a pretty nifty tower. I like the art style of this too. It's really nice. Is that the red faction? It's got red flags over there. Should we be worried or concerned? That's locked. I said there was a key up top here. I do not see a key unless it's on the table. It is. I'm a winner. Bridge key. Bucket of water. Whoop. No rails on the stairs. Is that how the builders met their fate? I am completely lost. There we go. Hello. I can't believe today is the 100th anniversary of our tower. I know others have been building much longer, and now I wish our grandparents had taken this whole thing more seriously. A hundred years ago, they decided things were getting dangerous, but why didn't they see the problem 200 years ago, or even longer? I'm still glad they started building, but I just wish we had seen this coming. Did I miss this? I did. Joey Diary, page 420. Whoever comes up with these numbers is great. I've been building all day long, and Bernie the Great and Terrible has been sitting on his butt acting as foreman. In other words, he doesn't do any work and drinks all our water. I've started locking my water chest just in case he really does think he's above us all. Well, he is the Great and Terrible, so... Self-proclaimed title, but the best one yet, I believe. Anybody else here? Nope. It's been quite some time since I was on the second tower. I haven't crossed this bridge since the builders became greedy and took the supplies that were meant to come to our tower. Just like all the other towers, its inhabitants quickly grew desperate and aggressive. So it is kind of like factions. Empty. It is kind of like factions. Kyle Diary, page 45. I guess I knew this day would come, but I didn't expect it to come this soon. Yesterday, we started extreme rationing of our water. A few days back, we stopped getting supplies from the ground crew on our lift. We can only assume that they stolen the supplies for themselves, ran out of water and food sources, or simply died. If we don't get into the cloud soon, we might need to see if we can get some from one of the neighboring towers. 
they aren't doing any better. Sorry to say. Hello? Another chest. Anything in the chest? Nothing in the chest. Very good. Another note. Hello. Where's that diary of page? 9,825. You are quite the writer. Dear diary, wouldn't it be ironic if it rained now after decades of building? Now would be the perfect time since we just started rationing our supplies more, but I have a good feeling about things. I know I've never seen rain myself, but grandmother always told me how wonderful it felt. It would be so surreal to be on the ground and see water for miles instead of desert and wasteland. I'm sure it will rain someday, we just need to survive until then. So it's a desert wasteland on Earth. Everyone is building giant towers heading towards the clouds due to a water. They installed a rope cart on this level to get to the third tower. I should be able to use it to get across. Yeah, that looks safe. Because there's a water scarcity. And it doesn't rain. That's not good. Ooh, is that a note? I do love me some note. Kyle, diary page 46. I tried to be reasonable. I tried to talk with them, but those greedy little scumbags on Tower 1 don't want to share their supplies with us. That's me. How dare you? I'm not going to die miles above the ground drying up like a raisin while other people watch. I'm going over there tonight to take everything I need so I can last long enough to watch everyone else die. Oh, Kyle, that's not very nice of you. Anything up here? Anything at all. Anything at all. Any notes? No, just a great view of the abyss. Awesome. Love the abyss. Good stuff, good stuff all around. How does it work? Does it just work? Ah, it just works. Beautiful. I'm sure this is fine. Yump it. Oh, there's one down there. Couldn't I have used that? Or is it because the stairs were broken? I could almost call this place beautiful if these dust storms weren't so suffocating. Ye would not be a good time to be an asthmatic. I would probably suffer and perish quickly. I hope I find what I'm looking for at the fourth tower. What exactly are we looking for, good sir? And dang, diary page one, I couldn't be more frustrated right now, we're running out of water, running out of building supplies, and Carl just won't get along with me. At least five times a day he pretends he's going to push me off the tower. I swear if I do fall someday it'll be his fault. Hey dang, not having a good time. Joey, diary page 556, yesterday hey dang fell off the tower. I don't know how it happened, but it was a shame, especially since he had the key to most of our water chest. We'll need to break the locked ones open soon, since we've almost emptied out the other chests. Well, I got a feeling that uh, Carl might be behind this. Hello? Nothing over there. What do we got? Carl, diary page 57. I just can't get over it. Hey Dang gives the absolute best reactions when I mess with him. For the past week, I've been pretending to get mad and shove my arms at him as if to push him off the tower. I don't think this will ever get old, and I can tell Hey Dang loves it. You murdered Hey Dang. I know you did. <laughs> and uh, yeah, he loved it. Every moment. I just read a note by him. He loved it. Fourth tower, oh. Looks like I'll need to fix this bridge. It would appear. Do I have lumber? Dang, I'm a pack mule. Just flop it in. There we go. Beautiful. This is how bridges work. Hey, did it. It's hard to believe that I'm the last one here. I never thought it would end like this. Makes you wonder what the whole point was in the first place. Survival? A note of ambition. Out of everyone on this earth, our families were the ones who took the water crisis seriously. We were the ones who started building. We were mocked and told we were insane. We were the ones who everyone looked to when the lakes and rivers dried up. Our blueprints were the ones that were stolen as people became desperate. Out of everyone on this earth, we are the ones who deserve to survive. The clouds are brimming with liquid life, but are still so evasive. 
We've been building for a long time, but we're not done yet. We have farther to go. We will climb the clouds. The son of Zilchar. Dewey, diary page 490. This evening, Kevin made a really cheesy speech about how we alone will prevail and how we're the only descendants of the great ones who deserve life. It was honestly the cringiest speech I've ever heard, and that's really saying a lot considering the other stuff he's been saying lately. He also keeps referring to himself in the third person and only responds to us if we call him Son of Zilshar. Awesome. So, giant wasteland, everyone starts building towers for what appears to be generations trying to get water as a resource from the clouds to survive. That is quite a way to live. What? Oh, nothing. I need more lumber. Do we have any lumber? That is a lot of lumber. I'm just doing that. Oh, saw. And a hammer. We got a lot of stuff now. Any notes? Nope, okay. Whoop. Whoop, whoop, whoop. This is how stairs work. 100%. Man, a building this was it's this easy. How come we didn't make it to the clouds earlier? This place really is beautiful, even with the dust storms. It's peaceful in a way. I've been working on that tower my whole life and never once stopped to appreciate what we'd spent our lives building. We only looked up to the clouds, hoping we'd someday reach them so we could prolong our lives. But now that everyone's gone, I know any attempt I might make at accomplishing that would be futile. Rather than spending the rest of my life building a tower, maybe it's time I took a break. It's been a long time, but I think I'm finally done. Fair. That was awesome. I love the concept too. Thank you so much for watching. Hit subscribe to become a Bobby Bite today and the bell icon to get notified when the next video comes out. Like on the video if you enjoyed and I will see you in the next one.